Angels, what is going on? The champ Strider here. And it seems every uh, every few months I hit complete Escape from Tarkov Obsession. And I'm in it full swing right now. So I figured I'd come back with another video, guys, for you to share kind of my key bindings and keys that I found that make Tarkov a little bit easier to navigate. And should make you a little bit more successful in some fights. So as we scroll down here, you can see there are an absolute ton, a ton of key bindings. And some of them are kind of kind of redundant, where there's like multiple different ways of leaning and peeking. And you don't necessarily need to use all of them. And some of the keys are just by default placed in really weird spots. So the first thing we want to do is if we look at our sprint key, it's, uh, it's left shift, which is great. That's what it is in every game. And if we look at our hold breath key, it's by default left alt. And that just feels absolutely terrible in a, uh, in a gunfight. And it's really hard to break like a multi-decade habit of holding left shift to hold breath so we want to switch that up but it won't work unless you do it a certain way so let's scroll back up to sprint so if we look at sprint um ignore this little joystick thing i must have had the joystick plugged in from when i was playing squadrons or something i i don't know how this came up but uh we want it to be on release if you look there's this little toggle menu which determines uh what type of input makes the command happen and if this is the same input as our hold breath, this trick will not work. So now go back to hold breath. So we'll have our hold breath at left shift again, but we have to keep it on the press uh, option. If you put it on continuous, which is probably what everyone's most used to, there will be a delay when you go to sprint. So we're going to keep it on press. And what that'll mean is if we go back to game here. It will stay held breath just on one press, and then you press it again to stop. But here's the thing. If I'm just holding it down, it still still will work. So that's the setting we want it to be on. So we're going to next look at our lean keys. And by default, they're E and Q. Here's, a, here's our leaning action. And the problem with the EQ lean binds is that it makes it very difficult if you want to take a little... A little step while you're uh while you're leaned in or you want to move forward or something while your your lean is on so we want to switch that up and what i actually use is if you look at my let's see my uh my razor viper right here has two little buttons on the side and i actually use mouse three and four to do my leans and uh that leaves my entire left hand free to do all the other million inputs that are in escape from tarkov while i'm fighting and just while we're talking about uh, leaning, the best way to kind of peek an angle is actually not to use the, uh, the lean feature in most situations. The best thing is to actually jiggle peek, which is just moving left and right and boom, 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 boom. And uh, that's because the peeker's advantage in this game is really, really strong. And uh, it'll actually win you more fights just jiggle peeking back and forth. So the next key bind that I really love that I think will help you guys out and make things easier is we took our lean off the E key. So I want to use that because it's a really easy key to access. And if we look at our variable scopes here, you want to be able to go from this to this quickly so that you can tell them some clowns. But by default, the key bind is Alt plus R. So we go in our settings, change scope magnification, and we want to change it to E because it's really easy to do that in a, in a fight. All right, Angels, so I hope that gave you a little bit of an insight on how I kind of do things with my mouse and keyboard to make the game a little bit smoother to play for me. And let me know if you guys have any questions setting things up. And let me know also in the comments if there's any other Escape from Tarkov content you guys would like me to get into. Uh, I know I have a different kind of play style than a lot of people. I play very, uh, very aggressively trying to hit eyes people all the time. And I have this weird system where I don't buy helmets, armor, guns, or backpacks. I just you know, collect what I take from people. It just makes the game more fun to me to have some, like, variety than to run meta stuff all the time. And if it's your first time in the channel, make sure you become an angel by subscribing. I release a ton of FPS content for a few different games, and you don't want to miss it. So I'll see you guys next week. Champ out.